pee pee. My camera is doing that disco party thing again. All trans peeping in the big boy party. I guess my advice to you would be don't be scared. They're nothing to worry about. I mean, for me, pre T, I never used the men's restroom. The first time was actually T day, and I went into a mall in Los Angeles, and Terry was like, no, you're coming in this bathroom, come with me, and then we went in, and I stood in line in the men's restroom. Number one, standing in line to use the stall in the men's restroom is awkward. There's no way around it. There's going to be awkward things in life, that is one of them. The thing that kind of sucks about using the stall at the men's restroom is that there's usually a guy taking a dump right next to you. But men's bathrooms are gross, usually, all of the time. Gross bathrooms. Always. Thickening. That just grosses me out. I still get nervous about it. For example, last weekend, I went to a casino with my girlfriend and her parents. And I had to go pee. Being with her parents, I felt more obligated to like be like a man and you know her dad's kind of a man's man I don't know I went into the men's restroom and all the stalls were taken up and so like I turned around and left and then I went back in and then turned around and left and then I went back in and then I left and then I went back in when the stalls was open but I kind of did the pee pee dance in and out of the bathroom and uh, the main thing that you're probably going to hear this week is that nobody cares. Like, the way it sounds, like, are they going to be listening to me? Everyone's worried about, oh, they're going to think that I'm doing something weird, or they're going to think that I'm a girl. Like, honestly, their first thought if you go into a stall is that you got to go number two. I mean, people ask about it all the time. It's a really common thing to be uncomfortable about, obviously. Like, you don't go into the men's restroom until you start transitioning. Yeah, so it, it takes some getting used to. People worry about, oh, they're going to see that my feet are facing out and not in, and they're going to wonder why I'm sitting down. And, you know, probably nobody cares. And if they do wonder, their first thought isn't going to be that you're a female which you're not. <laughs> but, you know, somebody made a good point in the discussion group the other week that guys who have piercings in their wieners have to sit down to pee. And then, you know, there's the STPs and, and some guys are just pee shy. I have not perfected the art of the STP. I don't always use the men's restroom, but when I do, I use a stall. I mean, I don't really have any advice other than that. All I have is advice that's been given to me, which is like, don't make eye contact, but why would you? Like, you're not trying to, like, say what's up to guys in the men's restroom. Or maybe Val is, I don't know. 